scheduled Dr. McCabe for my liver surgery and Dr. Ellis for my father's transplant. Tell them to be ready within the hour. If you have any second thoughts, now's the time. None. Steve from administration called. We have a problem. Let's we'll solve it. You need a signature on your psych evaluation form. Without it, the hospital can't authorize surgery. Okay, we're gonna have to skip the formalities because we don't have time. No signature, no transplant. The part of my father's out of time, don't you understand? I'm not gonna waste a minute tracking down a shrink for a signature. You can be as overbearing and doctor godlike as you want. It won't help get your father a liver. A signed psych evaluation will. Epiphany's right, Patrick. There's a protocol in place. What, to protect the hospital and your backsides when my father slips away? I'm no fan of Iris Sneed, but she's right about this. The rules are there to protect you, to make sure you are not making any decision under duress. You questioning my mental stability? Don't cloud the issue. It does not work with me. Fine. Wait, don't do that. I wouldn't start. I'm not going to lose my father because some signature is missing on some stupid form. Well, then stop wasting time. Shut up and let me sign it. Your chicken scratch is looking for a one. I can match Lady's signature better than you can. This is forgery. You can get in a lot of trouble for this. You're welcome. Thank you. Let's go. Oh, well, look at that. Lainey's signature on the dotted line. And so fast, too. Doesn't take long to scribble a name. And she was standing right where you needed her to be at the exact moment you needed her to be there. Serendipity. I'll say. Lady was supposed to leave for a spa trip this morning. Like I said, some things just work out. <sighs> My father's losing ground every minute we waste on this. Why the hell are you two standing around? We have a liver to move. I know why you're here. To observe and bear witness. Right. Witness me with my shirt off. How cold, so I can't bust you for looking. Shame on you, Dr. Scorpio. Taking advantage of me in my weakened state. Well, I wasn't going to, but now that you mention it. Drake Sr. is prepped in OR2, ready to go. Can't figure why Patrick agreed to this, considering what Noah did to his own liver. I don't think your opinion is particularly relevant here, do you? Mm. Touché, Dr. Scorpio. And here we go. BP is dropping to 80 over 50. We're losing him. Open up the Riker's lactate. Mix up a dopamine drip to get a systolic over 100. Patrick's not gonna die. Cautery. Suction. He's back. All right, close him up. They stuttered Dr. Drake's transplant. You asked before why Patrick would agree to do the surgery? There's only one reason. Deep and abiding love. Still no word on how Noah's transplant is going? It'll probably be a while before we hear anything. You stepped in and saved Patrick's life. He's not gonna let go on you. Well, I don't think he will see it that way. He thinks he's invincible. Nothing wrong with that.
No. Nothing at all.